El Salvador has moved forward uh, for being one of the most violent countries around the world, being the most safest countries in Latin America. Well, one of the main politics, uh, not only for me, but also uh, given the mandate of the President Bukele, is that the embassies of El Salvador around the world, now 47, uh, they do a job that is productive and has an objective for the Salvadorian people. And that's why we created the Economical Promotion Program. Uh, we have economical counselors at this time. We have one here in Qatar. Uh, we have now political consultations with this uh, country because, because it is one of the main uh, foreign policies, one of the main spots where we would like to move forward. We are working not only in this sector, but also in, also in aeronautics because we know that we need to increase, to strengthen uh, how to move the products. So we are going to have meetings with Qatar Airways, for example. We are also going to have meetings with the Ministry of Municipality, with the Ministry of Transport, and for sure with the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. A month ago, for example, I signed an agreement with your country uh, on sports and on the development of the young people. And we really appreciate all the support that you're giving, uh, taking into consideration that El Salvador is going to be uh, the, the focal point uh, of the Central America and Caribbean uh, games this year. And for sure, the help of Qatar is important. Uh, a milestone, I think, could be to open the uh, economical uh, office here uh, in Qatar that was launched the last year. And I feel, and you will see here in Agrotech, that I feel uh, that that uh, help us to increase not only the exports to Qatar, but also the investment in Qatar in El Salvador. So you will find that the government of the President Bukele is working on security in El Salvador and also to give more opportunities to the people. And also we are working together with the agriculture sector. At this time, uh, we have now a plan launched uh, last year uh, to recover the agricultural field uh, of the country. And that's why uh, we are promoting our sector uh, here in this fair, but also in some other countries. You will find that the, the weather of El Salvador is really good. We have a tropical weather, so uh, we have a lot of potential on that, but we need investment. And we are also looking for investment in agro-industry in El Salvador too. Well, we had uh, this morning a meeting with uh, Hazard Foods and we will promote some cooperation projects in terms to improve the agro-industry in El Salvador because Qatar has a lot of experience in that. And uh, in El Salvador you will find that there is a new movement of the young people to invest in agro-industry, especially in coffee sector. We are using the diplomacy to bring more opportunities for the people for investment and also exports and promotion of tourism for El Salvador too.